Style definitions provide a great way to control a named set of properties for a certain element type when that style definition is used in multiple files. When a property requires a change that needs to be propagated across multiple designs, the change is best performed in the host file that contains the style, such as a design library. Once saved, those changes can be propagated to the design globally updating the elements. So let's jump into MicroStation where we are going to be changing a dimension through changing styles. Here we are inside of MicroStation and we have the elevation details DGN file open. We're gonna begin by opening up the models dialog where we are going to make the CW details model active. This model contains three details pertaining to the curtain walls. These details were copied from a previous metric project and need to be updated to match the standards for the current project. So let's zoom in, locating the curtain wall detail. Let's ensure to set the active level to A Anno Dims. Along the ribbon, from the Annotate tab, in the Dimensioning ribbon group, let's go ahead now and select the Change Dimensions tool. In the tool settings window, we're going to select the dimension style arch arrow. As we look at this detail, there are four dimensions that need to be updated, two on each side of the detail. We're going to then identify all of these, hence updating these dimensions. Now we're going to continue to locate and change all the dimensions for the curtain wall at footing one, And we're going to continue to locate and change all the dimensions for curtain wall at footing two. In this lesson, you learned how to change dimensions through changing styles. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.